All right, hello everybody, welcome back. Been a little while since I played last, because I've been on holidays, I've been away for a couple of weeks, like two and a half weeks-ish. Uh, but yeah, I'm back, hoping to get back into, you know, the rhythm of everything. And I'm checking out the new weekly, because that released like two days ago, yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. And uh, no idea what I'm going to do yet, this is my first try. Uh, probably going to do like Lynx Crocodile, because I do love snipers, but we'll see. There's also a monkey, which is always great scaling. All those is fine. I'm gonna leave the rest because I'm hoping to get a combination for tier two. But yeah, no idea how people are playing this weekly yet. And I may be a little bit rusty. <laughs> I have not been playing much. Not been playing much recently. Mama set, probably. Yeah, I think combine those, do that. Because all of these have decent sell abilities, so if I want to sell anything individually, I'd rather it be these things. But I don't know. Ideally, I'd keep all of these around and hope to get some. Nice combos from them. And that is a loss. Oh well, we don't we don't lose anything for that. Okay. Uh wombats. How many pink pets are there? I'm seeing just like one up here. Maybe missing something, a couple there. Come on, there actually are a handful here. I don't think the mandrill's gonna be very useful. Yeah, probably not. Um, I may take a wombat though, that's not too bad. I don't know if squid's gonna be very good though, so yeah, I'll do that. Then roll. Snail. End turn if you lost one HP. Or lost last lost the last battle, give one HP to all friendly pets. Uh doesn't sound great to me. I think I'm probably gonna double sell possum here and just have a really big hedgehog. I don't think it can hit that. I mean it didn't, so I'm <laughs> I'm trusting that that's true. All of those, love it. And I'm just gonna roll again. Like some of this stuff isn't that bad, but I'm fine. And where do I want this? Do I maybe I want it really far forward? Because unless they have snipes themselves, then nothing on my team dies. Yeah, and they don't have any summons. Yeah, that's fine. It's not a win, but <laughs> it's good enough. Okay. Uh, oh, more of them, great. Ooh, wait, are there any there is this guy that summons things. It doesn't look like there are any more, but I don't know if that's a good reason to go for, like, multiple hedgehogs to guarantee that I can't win. So, I may... Yeah, I, I think I'm going to combine these, play that. I'm going to shuffle these around a bit. I'm not buying a meat bone, I just... I don't like that enough. Or maybe I do. <laughs> I kind of prefer it over the rest of this. Maybe go to you, because I can always get rid of that. So, maybe have that at the front. And... I'm going to send it that way. This way. As long as they don't have, like, snipes themselves that can mess me up. They kind of do, but the snipes don't really matter. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Alright, definitely combine. Deer and Llama. Early Llama is good, but Deer is more interesting. Is there a place for a Deer long term? I'm not really seeing it. But I also don't know if I want a llama, because they're just kind of eh. But there is garlic. So, probably. Probably that. I'll just, I don't know, get rid of something here. Um, I could also go for elephant, because I can always go for, like, elephant blowfish and hedgehog for a bit, and then get rid of that later. But, yeah, I think this is happening. Let's leave these. Just roll once. And we did get a combination. Great. <laughs> it's another llama. Okay, never mind. We're doing a llama squad. Um, definitely selling this. We are having a second llama. And who do I get rid of? Probably the chipmunk, because this is a tier 2, so it's not likely to be better than this. Just sell it, buy the thing, and then roll. Or maybe not even buy the thing. Like, it's one gold, but I don't care for the equipment, and I'd rather just get garlic on these as soon as possible. So I actually may just sell this now and just roll the um the thing. Yeah, like, I don't think I really need that. Let's just... Yeah, garlic, excellent. And I'm going to buy one right away. I'm going to shuffle those around. And <laughs> set it like this. I don't think it really matters. But yeah, the goal is to get many more llamas. May take a little while to find more, but I trust they're out there. Okay. Want another garlic for you. I'm not touching a snail. Yay, another garlic. Great. Um, that is a combo, and I may do it now because, again, more chance for Llama. From tier 5, there are better things. Cause, like, For example, if I am going for a full Llama squad, then it may be better to scale with a monkey for a while instead of just going straight into four Llamas ASAP. 
But yeah, I think I'm just going <laughs> to combine this now and hope for another one. Um, we didn't find it, which is a shame. I don't know whether I want to sell this just to buy a deer. I think I'd rather just kind of wait. Yeah, I'm just going to roll. Like, I don't really care about any of these that much. Uh, just keep rolling. We'll wait. Wait it out. Do it that way. I don't mind these taking two damage. I kind of like having a hedgehog a little bit further forward. And what is that team? <laughs> Frontline leech and like tamarin and triple snail. I like it. All right. More llamas. I care for nothing else. I do enjoy lynx and I would love to have a sniper squad, but not this game. Not this game. Just more of these. Good pillar turtle. And that is the only way to get Melanama, as far as I can tell. But maybe later. I don't think it's good for me right now. So, yeah, going to dip that one. I could just buy, like, avocado or something. But I'm really hoping I find more levels for these. Come on. Please. Just, like, one more. If not a level, then just show me another one. Well, not a level, but, you know. <laughs> It's not like these are going to get to 50-50 by themselves now that there's um, scaling plus one plus two. And yo, I copied a deer and it was amazing. Thank you for the carry, Wombats. I don't care. Like, this is doing work. Like, I will waste these turns if I have to. Apparently I do. Yeah, I'm, I'm still leaving the turtle pill. I just don't care. Next time we can find monkeys or something and we can, we can do some other weird stuff, I guess. And that's going to be a loss, right? Yeah. Oh, it's not. I didn't die. Okay, great. I don't know if I want to, like, draw with this team, but that's manageable. And chilling in these makes sense if I were to keep them. But I don't want to keep them, so I'm not going to do that. Double goats. You don't work with chicken anymore. Is there any other buy-selling stuff in this pack? There might be, but I'm not really seeing anything. Uh, there we go, another one. Okay. Let's get rid of the Wombats and play you. I know people aren't, probably aren't going to have many um, melons around, but it could be good to have this and then garlic and everything else. Like, kind of protection. Could also seal scale, but like these really have scaling. Show me a monkey or something. Not going to buy another garlic here. I don't think that is good enough for me at the moment. And... Ooh, maybe combine in. I think it might be better to just have like one... One of these scaling faster instead of just like stacking that there or selling hedgehog for a fourth. So I'm going to immediately level one of these. Um, I do enjoy a snake. I may freeze that. Maybe I don't go for like a full llama squad. I, I don't mind having a snake in here. That's cool. Do that. Send again. Running at three squads, so <laughs> not going to have quite as many things as other people, but still pretty nice. And that works. Cool, still at 4 HP, how? <laughs> okay. Uh, just keep rolling. I could buy taco or something, but... And I actually don't mind that, but I kind of want to have... Maybe like double llama, double snake, and that could be my build. But then I don't want to buy that. Let's look for chocolate or something, or another llama. I'm not going triple llama, just stack that there. We can get it leveled up later. But now we're just going to be looking for XP, really, and maybe a mushroom or something for that, if that's in the pack. I need something to protect the snake, which may end up having to be a turtle, but yeah, we'll see. Oh, the snipes are good. <laughs> Buy and pill chicken for expensive can. Uh, no. Double Stegosaurus. So that is massive, like very, very good stats. It's not scaling in the same way that llamas are, but it's still kind of scaling to get an extra 1-1 a turn. More if um, you do level them up. But it means I can't have equipment on those things unless I also have a turtle. And if I was going to do that, I probably should have had the turtle to start, so I'm just going to ignore it. Like, let's go for the, the llama snake dream that I was talking about. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I'll freeze that. Oh, and there's the other one. Okay, cool. I am getting rid of hedgehog now. Put you back there. I can't buy chicken legs, but I really want to get better things. Like, I want to level things more than just buying, like, 3 3 stats. I know I rolled the other one as well. I will, however, freeze a lot of these things. Um, there is no... was it? Chameleon? Yeah, so, this is good, but it's not permanent value. And, let's send it. 
Okay, I'm liking the look at this team. This is probably the team until the end. I don't know if it's strong enough to win, but it's not terrible, so maybe. I'm gonna have to win soon if I have a chance though, because this is not going to scale well compared to other late game teams. And would I rather pill a turtle or pill mammoth? I'm doing one of them. This is 8-8 eight, eight in stats, but shield on there may be better at this stage. Um, I'm going to do the shield first, I think. Hmm. And the mongoose. Eh. Okay, I'm going to use the mongoose for the stats as well, because like, we have HP. Instead of going for like the coconut one or something. Alright, so let's get the television. Sell again, just roll. Another pill, great. Okay. I like it. So originally I was thinking pilling turtle onto these guys, because they do need something to protect them, but... Oh, and I'm very glad I had that. Okay. Okay, turtle armor, very helpful. Or melon armor. Um, okay, free money, always like that. Then try and level up one of the snakes, I guess. Like, buy taco, I guess. It's also fine. Can't do anything else this turn. But that's not really a problem. Yeah, T-Rex would have been amazing. Like, T-Rex scaling is... It's just, like, one of the best in the game. Like, plus two, plus one for everything that else on your team uh, just scales insane towards the end. That is definitely a loss. Level three Stego. Okay, this is a very nice shop, though. Like, another Mongoose. We have a Turtle Pill already. And we can level up the Snake. Um, I'm going to start with leveling the Snake. Just to see what it gives me. Nothing I care about. Okay, I am going to... Pill that onto you. Maybe. It's just, the thing is, it doesn't matter. Unless it dies to snipes, or, you know, would die to snipes, then I don't really care about it. Like, I think that on there makes a lot more sense for me. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. I am going to buy Mongoose. I think I may just buy, um... I don't know. <laughs> like, air palm tree in case I get sniped off or something, but... Things it's not that likely to happen, so I'm going to risk this again. And just hope it works out. Have a little gap here as well in case anyone's running frontline chili. They do have snipes, but it's backline only, and my snake was actually big enough to survive it, which is amazing. Come on, eight and three. Two more wins, please. We are so close. And do tacos do anything for me? <laughs> I can't tell. They may need it. Like, the stats aren't that bad. These things are pretty much healthy enough now. Like, they'll get themselves over the ridge um, by themselves. I don't mind mushrooming you, actually. Yeah, okay. Mushroom you. Send again. I like it. This is a good team. Not as good as that team, though. <laughs> what is that? Ew. It was actually... Actually pretty close. But, yeah, no, that team was a lot better than mine. Okay. Yeah, if I'm buying one of these, I'm throwing it on one of the snakes. So I'm going to throw it here, I think. I don't think I'm going to mushroom that, because next time I find a turtle, I will be freezing that again. Like, I could just chili you or something, or pie. It's anything that's better, but I want specific things. Freeze it. Let's just keep rolling for now. And these are all pretty good. Okay, I'm taking air palm tree just in case this gets sniped off at the start. Because I'm pretty sure snipes go first and then the toy will trigger. So if this happens to get sniped off by starter combat abilities, then I'll have a chance to get my stuff back afterwards. But yeah, for the most part, we're probably not really going to get get like that much value out of this unless we're running against a 50-50 or something. And we did. It still didn't make a difference because it's still like double traded, but oh well. Okay. Do I just like buy these? Help. Feel trapped. I don't know what to do. Yeah, I'm just going to buy these, I think. I'm going to keep you frozen. And there's a level. Okay. Alright, well, we have some things here. Um, I can maybe try and swap in another thing now. Like, if this doesn't have equipment, I could always just play a Stegosaurus. Because these things, they've scaled enough. Like, they're both, like, capped out on HP now. It's like, maybe, probably not many other better things to play. So, sure, send it. Send it and dream. Oh. Defended against the chili. 
Yo, my snake survived like two shots back from the porcupine. Amazing. Nine and one. Yeah, I think I'm done with the llama scaling. Like, this is enough attack. They need to get to a turn from now on anyway, so. I think we do want to have another thing on the team now. So what, Bipil, Mammoth maybe? Again, I know these are already capped out on HP, but the stats are still pretty good, and then I can just end on this guy, and hopefully it will be good. Um, throw this to the back, probably. And I was hoping for equipment that would make some sense on this guy, but yeah, we do, do not have that, so I'm just going to keep rolling. Oops. Yeah, I'm not selling anything. We're done. This is the team. Okay, please. Please, have a chance. Yeah, you don't need the stats. It's fine, Llamas. Uh, 50-50s. Nah. <laughs> okay, well, it was an attempt. I had fun with that run, but yeah, this really wasn't the strat. I was hoping I could win early enough for Llama scaling to work, but it, it never... Never has a chance against actual scalers in the late game. You need to win by like turn 15 or something. And what was that? I just unlocked a new background. Was it clouds? I don't think I had clouds before. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. Okay. Let's do clouds. Flashbang backgrounds. Alright, attempt number two. Hopefully, hopefully we'll get a natural build this time instead of just going for whatever first um, meme I find. Be the delicious shovels. And that is a... Yeah, that's a draw. Cool. Alright, do I need to worry too much about the second fight then? So, I'm gonna buy that. I'm gonna ignore these two. I could just try and, like, pump up one of these by selling mouse, but... I'd rather try and find combos. So I'm fine running, like, a 5 squad here. And I don't think I need a 4th bluebird, so yeah, we'll just roll. Yeah, alright. We're good. And those buffs actually weren't that bad. Like, the hit on there was good, and then a hit on another blue bird was good, but expected, so. Yeah, that's fine. Right, let's get the combination first. Uh, I don't love either of these. I guess Tamarin maybe, but it has been nerfed. So I'm not the biggest fan, but it's it's still fine, especially if I have a blue bird. So like, maybe it'll eat up a load of stats and actually be kind of useful. As for the rest of these, I'll maybe take a Flamingo, but I don't care about the others. Not that I care about Flamingo, but, you know. Okay, freeze these. I may pull Flamingo on some stuff here, like, onto those isn't too bad. But, what's the best order? Yeah, something like this, I think. Assuming nothing at the back gets sniped at the start, but I don't think there's anything big enough to do that yet. I think the only sniper is Mosquito at the stage. Well, Hedgehog. <laughs> there is also a Hedgehog. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna pill that onto these two, I think. Like, I don't need more of these. I may just end on another one, but... Yeah, we'll just use them for stats. Definitely don't need more of those. I don't think I want to go for a Bat Squad, because as much as I like them, um, it's gonna be difficult to make it fit into a Lynx and Crocodile build, just because it would have to be higher attack than those, and I won't be focusing on giving things attack, so... Yeah, I don't know. I need more desk space. I was trying to get like to the left of that and I couldn't move my mouse far enough. Yeah, just roll. I don't care about any of this. Okay. Let's send it that way. Okay, that was the worst hit. That is just like a loss of stats now. Uh yeah, okay. Close, but no. Right, combination, anything good? The Llama, no. Well, I say no. It could be good to have just as a solo thing for a little while anyway. But I'm not going to be sticking with a Llama squad or game is what I is what I actually mean. Okay, put that onto there. Um, I could still buy some mice. Like, yeah, I'm going to be trying to keep you around for a little while. So let's give you some extra stats there. And we need garlic more than anything. I'm just going to leave... Like, this is the team, for now, anyway. Yeah, good. I need levels for this. This as well, I guess, but, you know, it's the only one we can find at the moment. And then I need to pump stats onto you. Alright, send again. Stop hitting the mama set. Uh, the longer I keep it, the more stats it's going to accidentally eat, but... 
the more stats it eats, the harder it is to sell. Hmm. Okay. I sell you again. Keep pumping the Tamarin. We definitely don't want another one of those. Still haven't seen any garlic unless I'm losing my mind. I'm going to leave this mouse. Alright, there we go. There's garlic as well. Um, I may sell this sooner rather than later. Like, if I find an early links or something, I may just sell it straight onto there, even though we don't get, you know, full value. Hey, there we go. A hit. It just means I don't need to invest in, like, garlic on this or something, and I can sell it and start scaling up something I may actually keep around for longer first. Alright, so what are you going to give me? Husky and crocodile. Ooh, Husky is pretty good. I would love to do a Husky scaling squad. And it may be better to start by finding early Huskies, so... I could. Crocodile makes the most sense, but I also have a team full of stuff without equipment, so... Maybe I just buy this and I don't even, like, have a an empty slot for the Llama. I just kind of let things scale. Start a battle if this is your lowest tier pet, gain Coconut Perk and plus 8 attack. This is also pretty tempting, because, again, it won't do anything until I have only Huskies, but Quad Husky and a Doberman could be a very good strat. So I'm actually going to roll one here. Yeah, I'm going to roll one. I'm going to sell my Tamarin, and you definitely trigger on the left. Yeah. Sell Tamarin, buff you up, play it. You're not going to be getting triggers, I do not care. You'll be scaling with um, Husky, so that's fine. And I don't think I'm going to try and level it, because I definitely won't be using it. I'm kind of just going to wait out the next few rounds, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of just going to wait. Ho hopefully survive to find more huskies. If we can get that off the ground, then that'd be amazing. And we actually won this round. Great. Alright, buy avocado. It is not bad, but like this team's fine. Don't care about links anymore. I already have a better idea <laughs> doing a dog squad. I just need to find them. Okay. Yo, another good hit with the uh, with the bluebird. Nice. That's another win, I think. It is cool. All right, we have three HP. That should be more than enough to find another husky or two, and we did. Okay, I'm selling Marmoset first because I hate it. Plus, it gives me some extra money. Um, I know there are other things I could buy that make sense, but I, I have a dream. I have a dream and I want to go for it. So we will be ignoring everything that isn't like Dobermans and Huskies. Obviously, if I find another Doberman, then I have to stack it if I do that, but... Oh, there we go. Llama or Bluebird first? Bluebird is still, like, giving me some value, so... I'll maybe be a bit greedy there. And I love this. Yeah, cool. Okay, neither of these do anything for me. I would have been tempted with a Stegosaurus this early. But... That's not the right thing to freeze. But yeah, no, this is great. And actually, big question. Do I sell Bluebird to get the Doberman to trigger this turn? Because I'd be losing a little bit of attack. But like, starting with a Coconut could actually be amazing. So I actually think I might do that. Oh, oh it's good. It's good, but I kind of wish I had it a little bit earlier. If I had played that differently, maybe I would have had it this turn. And ouch, that's gonna be a loss. Too many buses. Okay, we have time though. Still two HP. We now have the full, the full squad kind of. Um, I could stack that in there if I wanted to, and then like buy whatever the tier six is. How badly? No, this is the team I want. So we'll just ignore. Okay. Alright, shuffle you to the back. Everything else is fine where it is, I think. And now we just need to outscale other people. We need to get out of this horrible zone where we're very small on stats with no abilities. You know, buying this guy. And yeah, we may make it. Like, we, we are scaling very, very fast. Buy chicken leg. It's like nothing compared to scaling a husky or something, though. Or, you know, leveling these. But, I don't know, it's, it'd be kind of nice to get this guy more bounced out, so I'll buy one of these. Obviously not touching any equipment, because equipment ruins it. Taco is the same stats as the other one, but... Eh. Hey, we found the chocolate anyway. Okay. 
and Stegosaurus. It does fit the build. I will say that. It does fit the build. But we already have the build, so we don't need it. <laughs> Why take weird temporary scaling that kind of requires equipment to target where it goes when you can just have actual permanent scaling? It's great. So, yeah, what am I looking for now? <laughs> Do I just buy stats? Like, again, leveling these is now the only thing I'm really interested in. You don't need it, because you're going to get to max stats, like, very, very quickly. Yeah, I guess I'll just, like, buy some little stat food every now and then. Hey, another husky. Ignore the rest. Come on, this has to be the team. Yeah, look at that. These teams can't keep up. <laughs> We're too big, too early. I think we can just sit on this, and then we get to uh, near 50-50. Don't think anything's going to stop it. Take that. Loving these mongooses, but obviously do not have room for that. I'm not touching stakes or anything. There's the level for later. They're almost at like 30-30. It's like turn 13. Yeah, no, this is, this is great. I <laughs> got like three kills in with that front line. And it went up against a 50-50 right to the front, I think. Yeah, there's no reason to level the Doberman. Right? I already have the achievements and stuff, so I think, I, I think I'm good skipping this. Would have maybe been tempted earlier, but... Yeah, now that we have the scaling, there is no reason for it. And there we go, it's almost 50-50. Alright, nice. Yeah, yeah, that's a good team. Two more, two more trophies, and then we can jump ship. And I guess I'll just buy the chicken leg, because I don't know if we're going to get this thing leveled up again. Um, I also don't know if it matters where I throw these. I'm going to put it on you, because you're a higher level, and yeah, I'm just going to buy the taco as well. You're a higher level and uh, had lower stats, but yeah, it's all pretty meaningless at this point. Any stats I buy from the shop are next to nothing compared to the ones I'm getting <laughs> at the end of every turn normally. And damn, very glad that we blocked the peanuts there. Alright. So, this play makes no sense, but I am going to level this husky. We only get one turn of value out of it, but I'm happy. <laughs> Alright. Oh, so close to maxing out. If we draw them, maybe we'll get there. I'd have to buy a chicken stick thing for you, but... That's a solid, solid dog squad. My first win with the weekly, nice. Okay, cool. Fun game, fun game. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I will be trying to get like back into regular posting soon because I just um, got back from holiday and stuff. Can't remember if I included that at the start of the video, but yeah. Hopefully things will turn to normal soon. I'll be trying some other new things, but yeah. For now, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, and I will see you guys in the next one. All right, bye.